everyone. Today we're going to talk about Lambda React. This is a node package that scaffolds the Create React app, and it is specifically made for Lambda School students. You can visit the npmjs.co, and that's the node package manager uh, website there. And if you search for Lambda React, you'll find this in the instructions and different usage, but it's very simple. So all that you need to do is run in a open file. So somewhere where you do your projects, you can say NPX, and then we're going to do Lambda React. And for the app name, whatever it is that you want, I'm just going to call this YouTube. All right, so I'm going to let that get started. You notice there, it'll take a few minutes, so I'll speed this up and be back when it's done. This has finished installation, and there's a couple of important things I want you to look at. It does take a little bit longer than the Create React app, and part of that is due to this right here. So when you install Create React app. So this is taking the current version. Notice there's 3,592 low severity vulnerabilities. And it gives you this instruction to NPM audit fix in order to update that. Uh, this app or this scaffold will go ahead and do that for you. And notice at the end, it fixes all of the vulnerabilities currently set. And finally, it tells you, congratulations, you're all done. And CD into YouTube. So let's do that. And when we do, let's clear this. And when we do, you'll see all these standard uh, files there that are related to a Create React app with a couple of minor differences. If we go to the source, notice the test runners and all those extra files are gone. The index has been modified to remove the template that we normally get rid of as students while we're learning, as does the app.js provides us with a, a functional component here. And we have remove everything from this line to line 37. So you would just dump that when you're ready to go and you are up and running. Let's go ahead and look at this real fast. We can do NPM start. And it will open. A new Lambda student app. So congratulations and thank you for using the Lambda React. It is open source and feel free to make any contributions you feel that will improve it, especially during the month of October in celebration of Hacktoberfest. It is a opt-in project. So come by, put to use and uh, happy coding. Take care. Thank you.